got three up and three down. I thought motorcycle gears were one down, five up, but that sounds like a challenge. Hello everyone, I'm Fletch. Uh, and today um, we're doing a challenge called the three up and three down. This was a challenge that was put up by Smithy Independent Freedom. And what it is, is that three up is for you to do a shout out and to be able to promote a couple of uh, channels that you think is, that needs some love, right? And that's what we all do in the support MVC. And the other one, three down, is basically you know, three channels that you're down with. Uh, think channels that uh, may not necessarily be motor, uh, motor vlogging channels, but channels that uh, interest you or at least influence you in some way. So for 3 up, uh, the first one that uh, comes to mind uh, is a channel called Oak Leaf Moto. Uh, I believe he's a gentleman from Sweden. Uh, he rides a uh, fat boy, but he's got some great uh, motorcycle content, uh, some beautiful countryside on his rides. Uh, he does some hiking uh, and some travel as well. And I think you should check him out. It's Oak Leaf Moto, and that's the name of his channel. Now, the second one that uh, I would like to talk about is actually a very new channel. I've been following her uh, exploits, so to speak, on Instagram. And uh, the name of the channel is called Hell Yeah Jenny. Uh, and uh, she rides a uh, sportster, and she's from Canada. And recently, she actually did uh, a little uh, little show with uh, the two Kiwi riders, a really excellent show. She's just put up her first video. She's had the YouTube channel for a while and I think she's been thinking about it and do go over and give her some love uh, as well. Now the third shout out is going to one of our local YouTubers here in Singapore. The name of the channel is The Wandering Wasp uh, and basically she literally rode her scooter all the way from Singapore to Europe. It took her about a year and a half. Go and check her channel out. Inspirational. Uh, she rides a lot of motorcycles in her life, but she literally decided to quit a job and go straight and do this and to take something off a bucket list. And, and I think you should just take a look at Adventures. It is equivalent to the long way down as far as I'm concerned. And you get to see how a lone female, and I mean she did it alone, a lone female that rode from Singapore all the way to Europe. Along the way, she met other people, other riders as well, and she communicated with them and so forth. But basically, the journey is solo. Excellent video. So for the three channels that I'm down with, the first one, of course, is the Shade Tree Surgeon. I, I know that people say, that, oh yeah, you know, everybody's heard of him and everything else. But I know, I remember starting off many years ago when he first started out, uh, what, what I liked about him was his free-spirited, no holes barred uh, views about things. His talking head videos are the best, I think. You know, no holes barred, he talks about everything. He rides a lot of motorcycles, of course, primarily he rides a Harley, but he has other motorcycles as well. And I thought uh, it was a very interesting channel to follow through and I followed him through since uh, to this day. Uh, and I find that his content keeps me intrigued and, and, and I watch all his videos as well. Uh, it gives me inspiration to, to actually do what I'm doing here as well. Now, the other uh, channel that I'm down with is also still a motoblogging channel. Uh, Dan Dan the Fireman is the person I followed quite closely when he first started out. I remember he had, he still has a sports that I think he rides it. Uh, he did a lot of similar things that we were doing, motoblogging, but I think a lot of his contents as a firefighter was focused on safety, was focused on getting the right gear to make sure that you're safe on the ride. Uh, he actually uh, converted his uh, his sportster for off-road, which was really the most interesting thing for me. You know, I know that sportster is capable of a lot of things, but to take it off-road, that was uh, something else. And now he's actually putting out a lot of safety videos and videos that uh, guide us on the best way to protect ourselves while we're on the road not just about the gear, but uh, everything else. The last one, which is not a motor vlogging uh, channel, but I think this is a husband-wife team. They actually have their own 
uh, studio, or which they do wedding photography and videography, and and they do done commercials and everything else. And and I think it helps us, or helps me at least, uh, in terms to improve or try to improve uh, my videography and photography, and of course uh, the drones. Right? And they, even though the, the channel is called a drone film guide, they don't just concentrate on drones. They talk about the, the basics of photography and videography and how to get the best shots and how to actually put it in simply. And I mean, uh, whether it's it, there's, there's a thousand dollars or several thousand dollar drone or camera to all the way down to a little mini, they can show you what can be done putting the right principles in. So it's called a drone film guide. Uh, that's something that we should be looking at. And I think you all should check it out. Help me to a certain point uh, because I'm still learning. Right, and and I, I always watch all their videos, really very good. And of course, they had a, a recent one out on Final Cut Pro, which, since I'm using it, it was very valuable to me. Anyway, those are my three ups and three downs for this particular challenge. Thanks again for Smithy Independent Freedom uh, for putting it out. Uh, but I'm going to nominate three people uh, for this. Uh, the first one I'm going to nominate is Bodine52. Uh, you, you're, you're the first one on the list to do this. It's three up and three down. The second one is the Harley Road Show for you to do this challenge. I know you put a couple of challenges up for me on Instagram and I haven't gotten done yet. Sorry, mate. Uh, it's tough being in the house to do uh, shots of me and the motorcycle. And the third one I want to nominate, who's been nominating a lot of people, is JP1970. So JP, here's something for you to, do, to talk about uh, and do a video on. So again, uh, these are the three people, Bodine52, uh, uh, The Harley Road Show, and JP1970. I nominate you to do this challenge. Once again, folks, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if this is the first time you're here, thank you very much. If you haven't yet, please do click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the notification bell to let you know my next video. Thank you very much, folks. Uh, be safe and have safe rides.